bye week last week, I guess, what was the best part of that or the focus for you guys? I think the best part about it was the good on good work that we got. You know, guys, being able to see the young guys on the roster, the guys who need things to work on, uh, getting a chance to get that work is phenomenal for us. Uh, having the week and try to get healthy, especially after going at the uh, really tough Army opponent. You know, looking at Indiana on film, uh, you know, their offense, I guess, what stands out to you about them? I think they're very talented. You know, very talented uh, from the O-line to the running backs. Tight end and receivers uh, position are, I think, some of the best in the country. Uh, and I think the quarterback, I know a lot of people are talking about him. I think he's a phenomenal player. Like, he's he's really, really good. I think for them, you know, uh, played, played Iowa, they're tough. Cincinnati, sure, they're tough. Sure. I guess they play some tough teams, yeah. and now they're, they're mad to come here, like Coach Shelton said this week. Just, yeah. I guess from a defensive perspective, how do you guys just kind of you know, take that mindset and say, hey, the guys are ready, you got to yeah. contain them? Yeah, I think what it is, man, you got you got to match it. You know, that's what you got to do. They're going to come in mad. We got to come in and, and match that intensity. You know, we got to play hard. We got to play sound football. Uh, we got to be where we're supposed to be. You know, they're gonna, we're going to get their best shot, and we got to match that. That's, 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 what, that's what the game of football is, you know, matching your opponent. You know, uh, Coach, you know, you have two sacks. You know, through the first two weeks, you know, in the YouTube market, you were getting a lot of pressure. In the Army, obviously, they're very run heavy. Yeah. But, uh, you know, do you feel confident in your, like, you know, your front four that get that pressure, or are you going to maybe drop some blitzes in that game? Uh, yeah, I feel confident in the front four. I think they're still a the strength of the team. I think, they're, again, I think I'm going to the team get better with every uh, football game that we play. Uh, they're a talented bunch. I was that by the end Jones, those two guys are going to lead the charge and through the bye week and them getting back on track. I, I think they're just fine. We mix in pressures here and there as well, just like we always do. But I'm confident in those guys. Obviously, a much different offense than they faced against Army. Sure. Uh, they yeah. ran the ball a ton, but you know everybody's talking about you know Penix, Fry Fogel for Indiana. Sure. But you know when they run the ball, I guess what stands out to you about that? You know, side of their offense. I mean, they're a Big Ten football team. You know, and that's kind of that's part of the Big Ten DNA. You know, coming off the football, they're big up front. They're, they're strong, and you can tell the offensive linemen like they, they live for it when they call those running plays. And, and five and twenty and twenty-two, I think all their running backs they get behind their pass. They do a great job of running low, running with power, but they're also got really good quickness. You know, putting their foot in the ground and being able to cut and make breaks uh, as well. So I think they're a talented group uh, up front. Again, I know the the pass is sexy, but they do a good job in the run game. You know, uh, you know, talking about the run game, you know, you, you'll have like some, I guess, like some mishaps in sure. the first couple of yeah. uh, games this year. You know, what are you looking for to kind of just uh, reverse that trend yeah. and, and get back on the right path? Yeah, absolutely. I think it starts up front. You know, again, we got to play well. We got to get off blocks. You know, mm -hmm. more than anything, when you get off blocks up front, that frees up the linebackers. And then if they block the linebacker, it frees up the safeties to do what they've done. Uh, for years here in this defense. I think it's just a matter of us maturing and, and, and keeping our foot on the gas and continue to get better. But uh, the guys are grinding, the guys are working at it. You know, the, the bye week was huge for us. Again, to get some of those fundamentals down. And you know, even going against Army, some of that too, that, that, that run game, uh, I know it didn't show, but those, those techniques and things should still carry over. Yeah. You know, uh, the coaching cliche is the most important game is the next one. But, you know, you've been here longer than any of the coaches consecutive years. Yeah. You know, where does this game anticipation wise, the game wise kind of rank for you? Uh I mean I'm for me I'm just a kind of I'm, I'm an even guy. Yeah, very safe uh, answer. And and for me, you know, more than anything though, because the players are gonna go how I go. You know, if I get too excited, then they're gonna get too excited, then they're gonna come out so antsy that God knows what they'll do, you know, but you got, I gotta keep them. I have to keep the right mind frame so that they have the right mind frame. And at the moment, it doesn't get too big for them. Yes, we know it's a Big Ten opponent coming to our home. Uh, it's going to be packed. It's going to be a great atmosphere. So there's going to be enough energy around for everybody. You just got to get close to the stadium, and I think you'll feel it. But uh, it'll be a great time for sure.